Today, we'll cover 21 privacy fence ideas to keep your backyard private and peaceful. And I have a bit of a confession that I am obsessed with fences. Anytime we go on vacation or walk through any of our neighborhoods, I'm always taking pictures. The first one is a traditional wood fence. This is going to be perfect for anyone who doesn't want to think too much about their yard. You just want to set up a high level of security while also offering some kind of degree of flexibility in terms of style. A traditional wooden fence that can be easily customized to suit anything that you want, whether you want a rustic farmhouse look or a more modern and sleek design. In addition, wood fences are pretty easy to maintain and they can last for many years with proper care. Number two is a vinyl fence. So for many homeowners, a privacy fence is a top priority and a vinyl fence is an excellent option if you're looking for durable yet low maintenance fence. Number three is actually curtains. So this is perfect if you're wanting like a temporary style or if you're looking for a portable privacy solution for a small little area, then look at curtains as they're an excellent option. Something that most people don't even think about. Number four is a bamboo fence. Now this is, this could go a couple of different ways. You can either do bamboo as a living fence border. And this is actually something that our neighbors have. Eco-friendly, they're very durable. Bamboo is super fast growing, even in some areas that you don't want it to grow. You don't want to grow the bamboo, but you still like that look. There are also bamboo paneling that you can get. Number five is hedge fences. So this is a type of living fence that I've talked about. They're made up of plants that are trimmed and shaped to form a solid wall. Hedges are typically made from evergreen shrubs or hedges, such as boxwoods, privets, or hollies. Number seven are metal fences. And I've seen these pop up quite a bit on my travels when I'm scoping out backyards. In fact, this is one of the ones in our neighborhood. It was popping up. Metal fences, they're made from metal. So you can either get them in aluminum, steel, or wrought iron, and they're solid and durable. They can last for many years with the proper care. Number nine is trees and shrubberies. Now this is slightly different than the bushes earlier because we're talking about evergreen trees. It's another excellent way to create the private outdoor space. Number 10 is the partition fence. And this is a type of fence that's used to divide two areas. Partitions can come from a variety of different materials. You can do wood, metal, vinyl. The partitions typically used to divide the yards. Number 13 is the trellis fence. And this is just a type of fence that's made from wood or metal. But then you can also add a trellis and use it in the landscaping to support climbing plants. In addition, they can be used to block the view of one area from another. Number 14 is a popular, is a growing popular trend. It's called the living wall. And this is a type that's just made from plants. A lot of times people will build up an area where they can plant the plants in the wall. Number 16 is the brick fence. Super sturdy, cuts down on road noise even better. And a quick note to that, if you ever see a windy brick wall, know that that's actually called a crinkle crankle wall. Those are actually more sturdy and cost less than a regular brick wall. Number 17 is a cedar fence. It's just the type of fence that's made from cedar wood. So it's a wooden fence that people like because it's often used in landscaping. It's also often used to create boundaries or privacy screens. Number 18 is a painted fence. Painted fences are usually made of wood. This is our best friend's backyard. She wanted to give a little bit of flair to her backyard. And so she painted it one weekend. Number 19 is a living fence idea. Similar to the trees and shrubs and the living wall, they're slightly different in how you create them from plants. So living fences, they're often used in landscaping to create the boundaries and privacy screens. These plants are typically fast growing and they're dense. So they make very ideal for a privacy fence or blocking out unwanted views. Number 20, this is what I was talking about before. This is blended materials fence. This is our best friend's house. On the back, she painted it, but on the sides, we redid her fence. We didn't want an actual just wood, so we came up with a blended look. And now if you want to go a little bit deeper into any of these designs, like a horizontal fence or a stylish wooden fence, then check out this video next as we show you 11 horizontal fence ideas, plus a bonus, as well as 10 stylish wood fence ideas for your backyard. And I'll see you over there. 